So here's another Xbox game review where I review games on Xbox 360, Xbox One, Xbox Series S slash X, Windows 10 slash 11, Windows Live, iOS and Android, and the game the Fimbridge of Many of the series that um, any game that can play on on any Xbox any game they can play and get Xbox Gamer score in it'll be reviewed. This time I'm reviewing the Minecraft Xbox 360 edition. And this one it's like a your standard Minecraft. I thought you'd play like today it kinda is. Except it is a little bit outdated because you can't um there's like there is online mode capabilities like multiplayer but it's not like fully there. It's kinda like the early multiplayer. There was original Minecraft, like Xbox they called it Xbox One edition. And it was kinda like that um three sixty version. Except that um You know, it was pretty much like that, um, with outdated features and stuff. They just had, I mean, nowadays it's outdated. I mean, it wasn't outdated for then, but nowadays you can add, like, in Minecraft, you can add, play, like, servers or other people, play multiplayer with better people on, you know, I don't know, like, join, like, worlds, download worlds and play them on your Xbox or on your Windows PC and enjoying like land games you know you know if you know you can join like if you're playing on your pc you can join yourself on your xbox one you know you can't do that in the 360 so the only way you can download like a world would be you'd have to put it on like a usb flash drive or something like that and then f port it over to your um xbox 360 But, whatever. I mean, this is like, I mean, it's for it's the, and they do have a tutorial world in this version. And, you know, I've been using it to get some achievements. It's not bad, though. Um, although, they do treat it like a tutorial world, so you kind of have to go through some of the tutorials um, in this world. Which is whatever. But. I mean, I played. I mean, it's not bad Minecraft world for achievement hunting. I'm mean, using this world. It just takes a while to get the achievements in this version. It's not like it is nowadays where, like, oh, we have the Minecraft achievement world. No, you don't. Not in this version. I mean, there probably are people who make, like, Minecraft Xbox 360 achievement hunting world. Like, achievement worlds. I'm sure there are, but. They probably, you know what I mean? But, we'll see, you know, maybe, I mean, maybe you can get the version from, like, like 3, 6, maybe you can connect, you know, maybe you can get the new version stroke of the 360 version. Maybe so, we'll see, we'll see, I'm not, I'm not too sure on that one, but, yeah, it's just your, pretty much it's just your typical steer Minecraft. Game. It's just like an old, older version of it. It's kind of like it's kind of like a Java version. They have had like a Java download version. Before it was on like before Windows Ten launched, and it was on like the Windows Ten store and Eleven's Windows Ten store. It's kind of like a old Java. It's kind of like Java. Is what it seems like because it seems like PC version like Java get the most updates and then they would push out to like the consoles like the Xbox 360 and the PS3 and if there's a PS Vita version I don't know if there's a PS Vita version in Minecraft or a PSP version in Minecraft but if there was if there is it would be pushed in those consoles and PS Xbox 360 and the PS3 
after it was released in PC, like the Java version. And I'm not sure when they released like the phone version, like when they released like, iOS and Android versions. But yeah, they would. It's that's what kind of resembles so, like Java. And then they would just port the version from there to like some of this stuff and make it for, uh, for it. so it works in 360 and ES3 like the frame rate it's stuff they're allowed to use, you know. So yeah, it's kind of okay. Yeah, I guess it is what it is. I mean, I'd rather have the newer versions to be honest with you, because there are more features, there are a lot more stuff that you can add to it. Um, you, the only thing is, at least on the PC, for the newer versions, because I, I haven't played the Xbox One version yet, Minecraft Xbox One edition, or the new Minecraft and Xbox One. But, I don't know if they have multiplayer, you know, where you can do like the battles, but you can do that in the multiplayer version. Multiplayer Xbox 360, so that's a nice touch, but other than that, eh, it's all okay game. That's all new and okay game. I mean, uh, you know, I mean, I mean, it's a good, it's a decent game, but it doesn't stay in like test time with 360 version as well as some of the new versions and the more features. Though, you know what I mean? Which I kind of, you know, I don't mind the new features and the better graphics. But, you know, then again, for some of the limitations of the 360, you know. It's not terrible, though. It's not terrible. So I give that for this version probably... I'll give it probably a 7 out of 5. It's pretty good. But, you know, and just newer graphics and better, more features and more updates. The update version that's always up to date. Up, or, not up, I mean, not update all the time with the achievements, but updated like every so often here and there. You know? That's, you know what I mean? That's a nice little version. I mean, they update as much as they probably could. I imagine they update the 360 version as much as they could. Because there's a limit to, like, the achievements. On, like, 360, I believe you can only have, like, 99 or 100 achievements or something like that. Per game. And there's, like, a limitation to that. So they only added, like, Every achievement they could, so you don't know if like the new achievement updates or. But I'm sure they update as much as they could before, like, and you know, like they scaled the updates that there's update for. You know what I mean? They would scale back and only add like what they could in the update, or like they would like, you know, like not make it as high quality to try to work on the 360. Like the less, the lower limitations in like PS4, Xbox One, like PC, you know, they would just put it, you know, probably just put it within their limitations. Most standard you know, limitations, PC limitations that they have for the game. And then PS4, Xbox One limitations. And they would try to put in the PS3, say Xbox 360 limitations. And like the PS Vita or PSP limitations, they would probably try to. But, you know, but, after a while, they probably never updated the game, or, you know, probably one, could have been one, Minecraft Xbox One edition, was, was gone, removed, they just, um, probably stopped with the 360 version, and I just went to, like, a standard Minecraft version for when Xbox One, series, Xbox Series S slash X. So all the Xbox One games are, can play in series S slash X with better graphics. Like upscaling graphics. And stuff like that. And then Windows. iOS, Android, Kindle Fire. They all have their own separate versions. But they're all like tied in like one, one version that's pretty much the same. And it's pretty much all update the same. It's pretty much it all update the same. So. There you have it. That's my thoughts on Minecraft Xbox 360 edition, so it's secure.